Hi everyone, welcome back to another vlog. Hope you all are safe and keeping well. This weekend we've been to Harrogate in Yorkshire. On the way we found a beautiful farm shop which I couldn't ignore. So we took a break, stopped here at the farm shop and did some grocery shopping. So in my today's video sharing with you all my grocery shopping from this farm shop in Yorkshire. Do watch it till the end, you'll like it. Shopping at a farm shop is totally a different experience, especially when you have a big food hall and a beautiful farm surrounding it. The basic idea is to sell fresh farm foods to the locals at a reasonable price. These farm shops are almost open all the seven days in a week. The farm shop and cave fodder is the only business of its kind in UK where all the profits are donated to a farming charity that is the Yorkshire Agricultural Society. Now this particular farm shop is located very near to the Harrogate Junction and as you pass through this junction the building cutout and also the exterior designing is so beautiful that it definitely captures your eyes. Now as you enter the farm shop, you can see some beautiful visuals outside. It's a good place to walk around and spend some time. The fodder information clearly states that all the profits are donated to the Yorkshire Agricultural Society. It's kind of a huge support for the farming society. Now inside this farm shop, you have a fantastic food hall, comprehensive butchery, delicious deli and a busy cafe with popular takeaway. We started off buying some farm fresh vegetables here. You get all the regular vegetables which you normally get even in other supermarkets. But these are comparatively more fresh. I got to see some uh, black carrots which are quite rare in other supermarkets. So I bought some black carrots from here. You almost have all the different types of vegetables in here. I was trying to find out the different ones, the rare ones which you normally don't get at the other supermarkets. I found some fresh rosemary leaves here which you normally don't find it, it's quite rare. And also uh, broccoli which is uh, slightly purple in color. Other cabbage and other stuff which are in different colors you, you can also get in other supermarkets. Again zucchini is quite fresh here. So I bought some. You also have this pumpkins, turnips and different types of onions here. 
I bought some sweet potatoes and also farm fresh potatoes. You also have this rapeseed oil and also different types of vinegar selling here. Different types of mushroom are available here, both the brown and the white colors and also all the regular vegetables which we normally buy in other supermarkets like the tomatoes, capsicum, green chilies and stuff like that. You also have the fresh uh, poultry eggs, both hen and duck. Again, different varieties of meat is also available here. Different kinds of sausages, preserved meat and also the freezed ones, everything. Again, farm fresh seasonal fruits are available here and different types of vinegar. I found this apple cider vinegar in different flavors here. It's really good to see. You have different varieties of chocolates, nuts and cookies. It's kind of like a very interesting corner for the kids. This is again the butcher's uh, section. You can buy some fresh meat from here. You also have the ready to cook uh, seasoned and marinated meat as well. You also have bakery with coffee shop, we can buy and take away. So we bought some chicken samosa and also puffs from this bakery. You have different varieties of freshly baked cakes and also cookies here and it's also very famous for its buns especially the wheat bread I tried a couple of times but this time I didn't want it to buy because we already had some at home you get different varieties of cheese from these farm shops I sometimes buy cheese from here You also have these different varieties of organic fruit drinks which are made from fruits and also some of them are made even from nuts. They are quite healthy and uh, you get different varieties here. Again, you get different varieties of cakes here, even the shortbreads and also cakes in different flavors. Everything is very fresh and nice.
here in this section you get to see some pickles chutneys and also jams the sweet curd even with fruits everything is available here In this section some ready made meals and also soups are available. Uh, we took some garlic naan from here. Now here different varieties of tea and coffee are available. We used uh, almost all the varieties of tea here. Now and then I keep changing tea. Uh, the Yorkshire tea is good. We tried a couple of times. These tins contain the shortbreads, that is the butter cookies. I really love those tins. I used to collect them, uh, but then now we are all on diet, so didn't wanted to buy these uh, butter cookies. Dry fruits are good in farm shop. I buy them sometimes here. Different flavors of ice creams are also available here. We didn't try any ice creams here, but uh, they look good. I also like the beautiful collection of these cups and also soft toys, they're very pretty. Again you have some small collection of gift items like uh, women's scarves at reasonable prices, other soft toys and scented candles and stuff. Everything is very beautiful and arranged very well. You can plan your own gift boxes here or you can choose one of these. They are really so pretty. Mm -hmm. 
My overall experience at this farm shop is really great. It's a huge food hall with uh, decent arrangements of vegetables, fruits, meat items, bakery stuff and also dairy products and you get to see all these different varieties of gifts. It's really a good experience. I think it's worth coming once and doing your regular shopping. Aryan also enjoyed a lot shopping here. He found many different items which are farm fresh. He learned a lot from this farm shop as well. It's been quite some time now he didn't come out because of these COVID restrictions and stuff. We were not taking him out anywhere. So it was a kind of outing for him as well. The staff also are very nice and friendly. They gave us a lot of information about the farm shop and also the manager explained how the profits are being uh, given to the charitable organizations. It was indeed a very good experience shopping here. Outside the farm shop, we have some beautiful green lands wherein the sheep and lamb are grazing. It's quite interesting to watch them. So we thought of spending some time here walking around. I hope you liked my shopping experience at this farm shop. Do give me your suggestions and feedback in the comment section. I would love to hear from you. Also, if you're watching my channel for the first time and if you haven't subscribed yet, please hit that subscribe button and feel free to activate the bell icon at the bottom so that you'll be notified whenever I upload my new videos. Thanks for watching. Bye. See you in another vlog.